Chemical engineering is uh, the branch of engineering that deals with designing new materials and designing processes to make these materials. So whether or not it is beer, it is let's say gasoline, it is a plastic, it is let's say a new material for the chip in your cell phone, everything around us is made by a chemical engineer. We're really trying to solve problems that we didn't know we had maybe 30, 40 years ago and we will be solving these types of problems for the coming decades and centuries. One big one is this whole role of, let's say, circular economy or recycling. How do we design a process to improve the recycling of plastic and actually make it recyclable? Wind turbines. After a 25-year lifespan, what happens to that massive wind turbine? It has to get recycled somehow. Originally, I applied at the Schulich School of Engineering because I was passionate about Canada's energy systems and chemical engineering, and I also have the energy and environment minor. I felt like that combination sets me up really well to do large-scale work to help reduce the climate crisis. My favorite thing about the chemical engineering program has been definitely the people that I'm studying with. I also love the professors. They've all been really great. Courses have been really interesting. We do labs and the classes are delivered really well. If you look at the way we're teaching chemical engineering, we have a digital spine in our program where every single chemical engineer has a little bit of programming every single year. So how do you apply, let's say, data science or machine learning to a simple chemical engineering problem? How do you look at a system and model it? We really believe in hands-on learning, so there's labs and opportunities throughout to really try to understand what you're actually learning and then build up from there. I did do a research program over the summer. It was the Geothermal Energy Lab. So my job specifically, I helped a small team build or develop a web application. I've really enjoyed my time here being a chemical engineering student at Schulich. I get to participate in lots of student clubs. All of my favorite memories have come from these opportunities, whether it's traveling to Switzerland for a week to go look at nuclear plants, Lindt Chocolate Factory, or hiking in the Swiss Alps, or design clubs where you get to do anything from machine learning on robotics, building a solar-powered car, and I've gotten to learn so many important skills that I can use in my career once I graduate. There's tons of opportunities for graduates of chemical engineering. I'd say more than people think. I'm interested in studying textiles and how they behave, like dreaming really, really big, finding a sustainable, like one-use plastic sort of thing. So something that's not harmful to the environment. And I think a chemical engineering degree would be helpful for that sort of thing. We have people, um, graduates working in the medical field. You can go into high tech where computer chips, for instance, are made of functional materials that are designed by a chemical engineer. Pharmaceuticals, there's a huge amount of chemical engineering in the pharmaceutical industry. A couple of our graduates have gone out and started breweries. A lot of uh, chemical engineers actually work in water treatment and food security. So as a graduate of chemical engineering, the opportunities you have are quite limitless. 